Good morning, Trojans. Today is Tuesday, March 26th. It's National Spinach Day. It's also the last day before break. I'm Riley, and you're watching SC News. Let's send it out to Ronnie for the weather. Good morning, Trojans. I'm Ronnie, and here's today's weather. It's going to be high of 55, a low of 38, and it's going to be rainy. Now let's send it back to the studio. Thank you, Ronnie. For lunch today, we'll be having chicken patty sandwich, carrots, salad bar, fresh fruit, or fruit cup, and milk. SC News would like to wish a happy birthday to the following people who will celebrate their birthdays over break. Hannah Krugman, Christopher Case, and Mrs. Davey. SC Track travels to Mapleton for a meet today at 4.30 p.m. SC Softball has a home doubleheader scheduled for Saturday, March 30th with a start time of 11 a.m. SC Baseball takes on Seneca East Tigers on Thursday, March 28th. Varsity plays at home and JV is on the road. Both games begin at 5 p.m. Prom tickets are now on sale during lunch. Tickets are $20. You can sign up for table assignments when you're purchasing your ticket. The last day to purchase will be Tuesday, April 2nd. Stay tuned for Trivia Tuesday. What's up, brother? This is Q&A Monday with Danny Green. How many students in the United States go on spring break each year? Over a million. Point five to two million. So what percent of students get injured on spring break? Like, uh, 200. Percent? Oh, 50. 60. What is the number one business place for spring break? Florida. Yeah. Thanks. Marlon and Aiden. How many students in the United States go on spring break each year? 39. 42 million. 1.5 to 2 million. What percent of students get injured over spring break? 8 million. 16. 16 percent. 48 percent. 60. What is the number one visited place to go on spring break? Mexico. <laughs> Guatemala. Florida. Have a great day. Go Trojans.